What's going on, everybody? Happy Monday. I'm Coach Anderson, and welcome to HD ASVAB. So today, we have a class tonight for free. You can join, and we're going to be doing mean, median, and mode word problems. So let's go ahead and check out this example problem so you can see what you can expect, and then also I'll tell you what else we're going to be doing in that class. That way, you can raise your score the best way possible. So let's go ahead and get started here, my party people. First things first, if you don't already know, the first thing we need to do with any word problem at all, any problem in life, is understand the goal. Why are we here? What are we doing this for? What are we trying to achieve? And that's gonna be right here. What was the average or mean number of cupcakes sold per day over these four days? Right on. So I'm gonna go ahead and highlight that. What was the average? Again, specifically they're saying mean of those cupcakes sold per day over these four days. So the moment I see a very hyper-specific or a formulaic word like average or mean, I gotta think about that formula. I gotta be able to regurgitate that thing as soon as I see it. And so what that's gonna be is to get the mean, we are going to find the total of our values. So we will find the total of the values and then divide by the number of numbers right here. So let's go ahead and just take a look at this example. For example, <laughs> we're gonna say that, hey, look, if we're talking about these four days, we're dividing by four, that's it. We're just gonna divide by four and we are good. Now, the only real question is, how are we gonna get the total? Like, how are we gonna add all these things up? Well, we're just gonna read through the information, understand what we have, and then build that into the, the solution process. Nice and easy. So here's how that's gonna work. A local bakery keeps track of the number of cupcakes sold each day for four consecutive days. So back to back. On Monday, we have 48 cupcakes. Okay, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good start. I have Monday right here. So I'm gonna write down Monday. We got 48. Okay, sounds good. So when I'm writing out my formula right over here, we're gonna go ahead and say, again, we're dividing by four. The first number for Monday is 48. Again, at the top, we have to add everything up together. So let's check out Tuesday. Tuesday sales were 12 more than Mondays. So we're not putting 12 for Tuesday. I know there's gonna be a couple of folks out there that have a little bit of test anxiety, right? And we might take a look at that and in the process of being nervous, We'll see that 12 and we'll just want to go ahead and throw it in right here. But that's not what we should do. Read it carefully. It says that Tuesday sales were 12 more than Mondays. So if we want Tuesday, we have to ask ourselves, well, what's 12 more than Monday? Monday was 48, 48 plus 12, that's 60. So boom, we'll put 60 right there. Now let's go ahead and get into Wednesday. Now, as we're doing this, does it feel like this is actually a little more doable than freaking out and actually just trying to plug what you see? So if you wanna learn more about how to raise your score for free, I have a class tonight, my party people. I offer a free class every single week because that's what I do to give back to the community. And I love it. I love helping people succeed, whether you have money or not. So make sure to sign up for the free class tonight. That way you can raise your score with me live in class. And on top of that, you get my free practice test with step-by-step -step video solutions so you can learn from every single mistake. So go ahead, check out the link in the description of this video or go ahead and find the link somewhere here or in the bio. Make sure you're signed up so you can show up and raise your score. So let's keep it going here. Wednesday sales were double Tuesdays. Okay, double Tuesdays. So we have to make sure, let's highlight that. Wednesday, we doubled Tuesdays. So if we take a look at Tuesday, that's 160. If I double that for Wednesday, that's gonna be 120. Let's keep it going. Then lastly, Thursday sales were 20 less than Wednesdays. What does 20 less mean? It means we're taking away 20 from what we had on Wednesday. So therefore, Thursday will be 20 less, and that's gonna be 100. And there we go. Now that we have all that set up, we now know that we have everything we need to solve the problem. We said we wanted to find the mean. Okay, there's our formula. Now we have the numbers we're supposed to plug in. So now all we have to do is plug it in, solve, and we're done. So here we go. 48 plus 60 for Tuesday, 
120 for Wednesday and 100 for Thursday. If we add all of these up, you know, you can do this in a couple of different ways. You can just go ahead, mental math it up, add it all up, or you can just divide each of these by four and then add it up. Again, there's a bunch of different ways. I'm not gonna get into all the mental math theatrics right now. Let's just go ahead and add them together. So 100 plus 120 is 220. 220 plus 60 is 280. Then from 280, we're gonna add 48. So that's gonna be 328. Just nice and simple there. We have 328. And now we're dividing that by four, my part of people. What's 328 divided by four? 81. How did I know that? We'll take 320, divide that by four. That's a clean 80. Then you take the eight and you go ahead and divide that by four and that is two. So here it's going to be 82. And there we go, my party people. I may have this book and I may have said 81, but oh well. But with that, there you are, my party people. I love doing this. And obviously when I make mistakes, I love it when you guys catch it in the comment section. So here we are going to have 82 cupcakes. Booyah. There's our answer. Our correct answer here is B, 82 cupcakes. And we're all set to continue raising our scores, everybody. Before we leave, make sure to comment. But as always, I'll catch you in class tonight. It's the ASVAB, everybody. Cheers. Thanks for watching my ASVAB party, people. But do yourself a quick favor. If you like these videos, well then why not just join me for a free class once a week? Again, it's free for two hours so I can help you raise your confidence, get that score where you want it to be so you can enlist in the job you deserve. My party people, I'm Coach Anderson. Sign up, show up, and let's ace the ASVAB.